Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about four types of fronts that create some of our weather. Air masses that form from different areas often do not mix. The reason is that the air masses have different densities. For example, warm air is less dense than cold air. So when two types of air masses meet, warm air generally rises. The area in which the two types of air masses meet is called a front. The four kinds of fronts are called cold fronts, warm fronts, occluded fronts, and stationary fronts. In this demonstration, you can see colder green water move under warmer clear water and how the warm water moves above the cold water. This is very similar to how masses of air act. Up first is a cold front. A cold front forms where cold air moves under warm air, which is less dense, and pushes the warm air up. Cold fronts can move quickly and bring thunderstorms, heavy rain, or snow. Cooler weather usually follows a cold front because the air mass behind the cold front is cooler and drier. And here's the symbol for a cold front. A warm front forms where warm air moves over cold denser air. In a warm front, that warm air gradually replaces the cold air. Warm fronts generally bring drizzy rain and are followed by clear and warm weather. And here's the symbol for a warm front. An occluded front forms when warm air mass is caught between two colder air masses. The colder air mass moves under and pushes up the warm air mass. The coldest air mass then moves forward until it meets a cold air mass that is warmer and less dense. The colder of these two air masses moves under and pushes up the warm air mass. Sometimes though, the, the two colder air masses mix. An occluded front has cool temperatures and large amounts of rain and snow. And here's the symbol for an occluded front. And finally, a stationary front forms when a cold air mass meets a warm air mass. However, the both air masses do not have enough force to lift the warm air mass over the cold air mass, so the two air masses just remain separated. This may happen because there is not enough wind to keep the air masses pushing against each other. A stationary front often brings days of cloudy, wet weather. And here's the symbol for a stationary front. So there we go, four different fronts that create some of our weather. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.